Konnichiwa YouTubers, this is Red Stock straight from Point Magoo, California. Today we're going to do a video review of Super GoBots Optimus Prime. I mean, <laughs> Stacks. Sorry. It does look like it. Look at the box. And in fact, I think the Stacks are big. Because back in the day you can get away with that. Not so much. Made by Tonka. So if you remember the GoBots, made by Ta Tonka, friendly robot tractor. Oh, man, he's a whatever the good guys were called. Uh, I don't like that term, but if you want to read the guy's bio, there it is. Yeah. Uh, there's stacks, GoBots, vehicle. I like the fact, hey, they got a lot of chrome. And people don't give GoBots really much credit because their freaking robot phone worms are goofy. But their the robot, or sorry, their alt modes are to scale. And they're freaking wonderful. Uh, transformation, if, you know, it's really simple. I'm going to do this pretty much raw because, let's face it, it's a freaking GoBot. There's stacks. Alright, and see if I don't break the darn box. And as you noticed before, here, oh yeah, here's the price tag. Ain't that badass back in the day? <laughs> yeah. Try getting that for that sheet. Oh hey, comes with a sticker sheet too. Yeah, really don't need them. Comes with a couple of stacks, two of them. There we go. And we'll put that in robot mode. Comes packaged in robot mode. As you can see, articulation is pretty darn limited. He's got shoulder articulation, moves up and down. Uh, actually, pretty good. Even it's on a swivel joint, uh, double jointed, and that's good for transformation. His stacks, you can put them on his arms there. Yeah, look at that. Nice bright, bright orange color, so I like that. Stacks is, you know, what can I say? He stacks. <laughs> there you go. Size comparison with Megatron, so he's a deluxe size. Why is Megatron, Megatron hiding? There we go. There you go. Deluxe size. He's slightly larger than a deluxe, so he's looking good. Yeah, he has limited articulation, and I know the die cast on the legs helps him. Uh, that's about it for articulation there. Ankle articulation. That's to be expected, let's face it. Yeah, that's all you're going to get. Hey, he stacks. He looks good. I wish he had a face. That's one of the things. If you notice the old GoBots, uh, yeah, they didn't have heads. <laughs> I don't know why. The Super GoBots were like that. Weird. A lot of them were like that. Ah, weird ass fellow. Uh, I'll give him 5 out of 10 in this mode, but you'll see where he really shines in his uh, cab mode. And let me see. I haven't done this in a while, but we're going to flip his backpack. And I love the fact that the robot extras are hidden, so here we go. So maybe I'll give him a 6 out of 10 because, you know, they actually put some effort in this. His head just flips up, connects right here, and the legs just flip right down. And let me see, what does it say? Made by Bandai. So man, Bandai did everything back in the day. Yep, Bandai, 1984, Japan. So yeah, die cast. Fold his arms up. Yeah, yeah, like this is really difficult. Stacks will pop in right here on the sides, and notice that they're decent size. They're not like the little wimpy ones that we were used to. There he is. Look good, man. He looks good. Love the cab mode. Very detailed. Look at that. Nice chrome. Chromed out in the front there. The passenger seat chrome in the front. A lot of detailing. Stickers already applied. Good detailing. And I tell you what, what his robot mode looking kind of ugly, but from underneath he just hides everything freaking beautifully. And this is to scale. Don't know exactly what scale this is. Mostly like 132nd or something like that. Actually smaller for this, 137th. But yeah, beautiful, beautiful alt mode. Can't get, can't beat that. Eat your heart out, Optimus. <laughs> Give him a 9 out of 10. Look at that, it looks great. That's all I got, YouTubers. I'll catch y'all next time.